So officers in Amity shot and killed a man after someone called to report that he had broken into their house. This happened around 5.30 this morning. And Coin 6's Jennifer Dowling is live near that home where the break-in took place. Jennifer. That's right, Trevor. I think we're about three blocks from the home where the actual uh, break-in uh, home was located. This is where the man was shot by officers after they caught up with him a few minutes after they arrived at the homeowner's house who had called 911. Now, we did speak with one neighbor who told us that she heard a couple shots but didn't realize what was going on. It didn't sound exactly like fireworks, but it was very loud. And then uh, when her husband came outside, he saw uh, someone covered up a uh, body, presumably, uh, by one of the fences over here. So just a scary situation for folks who live in this area, something very scary to wake up to. Officers say that the homeowner or the resident of the home actually called them around 5.30 in the morning, called 911 and said that uh, someone was in the home and appeared intoxicated. That man then ran from the home, came down here to Rice and Jellison, uh, the intersection, and uh, that's where police located him and opened fire. And he was announced, uh, excuse me, uh, declared deceased at the scene there they couldn't save him although EMTs did try once they arrived now the officers are on administrative leave at this time uh, deputies radioed immediately that shots were fired we do have uh, some uh, comments from a neighbor who did hear the shots take a listen wow this is this is so different for for amity i mean amity you know we're just a little old town people know people and you know, just all friendly and then have something like that happen. It's kind of different. The deputies who fired at him are on administrative leave. The Yamhill County Major Crime Response Team has been called in to investigate. Representatives from the Newburgh Dundee Police Department are leading this investigation. The man's name has yet to be released. They are notifying family members, according to officers that are leading uh, this investigation, heading it up. And so just a scary situation for neighbors out here in the Amity area. This is typically a small town. It's very quiet and people uh, don't usually see this type of activity. Some people don't even lock their doors out here because it's such a friendly community. So certainly a surprise overnight with this officer involved shooting. Back to you, Trevor.